What's up guys, this is Trey with Smart Home Starter and today we're going to do a quick video about how to reset a Samsung TV when you don't have a remote. So very clearly you guys can see that uh, I do have the remote but we're just going to toss this out of the way and see what we can do. So with the keyboard connected to the USB port of the Samsung TV, what you're gonna to wanna to do is uh, press the command or the windows and the escape key at the same time. What I notice is sometimes if you only press the command or windows key, the reset option doesn't appear, so you're gonna to wanna to press them both at the same time. Now what that's gonna do is open up a window and from, or it's gonna open up our settings window where we can scroll down to the uh, general section and then from general uh, we can scroll down again to the reset and then we can start walking through uh, the reset of the TV steps or as you select reset and then on the next screen you're just going to put in the code if you have one if you don't the default pin is zero 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 So our next option is to uh, download the Samsung SmartThings app and get the TV connected to it. So from the uh, app, we're going to go in and add a device. Um, I'm just going to scan for nearby devices that pulled up the TV immediately, and we're just going to add that. So it's going to you know, go through the steps, um, choose the location, the room, and then select the next button, connect it. Uh, pretty, pretty nice animations here. Um, so it looked like this was under my partner, so we're going to switch that out. Select OK on your TV. So this is really interesting. You might have to have the keyboard connected to the um, to the TV to get past this. If you don't have the remote, I did have to use my uh, Enter key on the keyboard. So right now, what you're not seeing on the TV is a pin that's showing. And I'm just grabbing that pin and inputting it here. To verify this and letting it load processing and let's see here we go so it looks like it's registering to the account. This is a fun animation. So what this is going to do is once it's all, all connected, it's going to give us access to uh, the, the remote through the app. And it's just going to be another way to control your Samsung TV uh, without a remote control. So here we go. We've got the TV connected. And if I select the remote, I have all these different ways to, um, to, to, to control the TV. So uh, pretty straightforward here. And yeah, it's a great way uh, to operate your Samsung TV without a remote. So if you guys could, um, you know, please like and subscribe. Uh, we'd love to know what type of content you want to see from us next. And until the next video.